what's going on y'all back out here again another park vlog how's your day going hey bro don't be trying to slide out when you see me come on bro get your sit down bro bitch ass nigga i seen you trying to slide out you're talking about to go to home sit down give me 10 minutes anyway bro yesterday for me bro went so fast i went downtown i told you about this yesterday i went downtown on by uh um, i think about morning steakhouse and I didn't eat there, I was just where I was by. Then I went by the, the bridge, I went to the water. Bro, if you are a, I got the signs here, but off the top of my head, if you are a fire sign, please light a candle and keep it by you at all the time. If you're not, just get a white one. Just keep fire by you, right? If you are a fucking water sign, get your ass by some water or just keep water by you all the time, right? If you are an earth sign, go get your damn toes in the damn grass Feel me and if you're an air sign keep a fan on your ass <laughs> you know what i'm saying but look at the end of our day i mean at the end of the day you need to get your nato chart which is you can go to um your nato chart season and you can go get it at um what is it free uh, cafeastrology.com and they do free ones but you need to know the time of your when you were born as well like you feel me? Because they got a time, they got a little slot for time, and you niggas don't be knowing what time they was born. You know what I mean? It'll be in the day sometime. July uh, 4th, yeah, that's my. Oh, wait, no, it's not. You <laughs> old ass nigga shit. But, um, it's so imperative, and you need to get your, um, what else do you need to get? You need to get you a, um, a birth chart. What I did is I got a blank one. I went to, um, what is it, FedEx right there on Arden, and they put a plastic cover over it. You feel me? So you can just erase it with a dry, uh, get a dry erase and like some paper towel and you could change it. You can put your rooms in there. You can put different things. You need to know what, do I got mine with me so I can show y'all? I might got it with me. Let me see. But, um, you got it. It's important to have, bro. It's hell important to have, bro. Look at my photo, bro. Going crazy, nigga. What you mean? Stab you, man. No, I don't got it with me. But, uh, it's at the house. But look, next time I come on, I'm going to have it for y'all we gotta talk about but look when these people tell you these people are connected with all their ancestor stuff right they know about all their ancestor stuff right you don't think it's like really like i don't know like suspicious at best that they tell you if you start trying to learn about your ancestors or if you try to tap back in that you're doing evil shit and then they'll convince everybody else that it's evil shit but they know everything about nigga man I was watching something about this dude was breaking down the um, dollar bill and everything that they have magical that's on the dollar bill. Why you think dudes kill their fellow dude they've been with? I mean, not been with, they've been. They say man since elementary school and they get over a fight over 20 bucks and he kills a nigga. Or he feels whole nigga that nigga didn't give him his $20 on time. So next time he sees him, he kills him. But he known him for 20 years, nigga. He knows his kids, nigga. He knows his wife. He knows his mama. They've been on for Thanksgiving. They didn't share shoes. They didn't share jeans. Everything. Right? It's because it's powerful. It's blue face has a white man tatted on him. You feel me? So it's like, bro, like, it's just, it just goes to show you, like, if you don't know, ignorance is not an excuse. If they just use that, like, as the law here, no, motherfucker, like, in general. And it's just, I done did stupid shit for money. I can't say, I mean, I've done it. So I'm not trying to just talk about anybody that's ever done stupid, anything stupid for money, but. I'm saying, but I'm not saying, bro. You just gotta be more aware. I noticed that awareness is key. I know I keep saying that, but you have to be aware of like everything. Like that's why you always gotta have your your pulse. I mean, have your fingers on the pulse of the hood or wherever you wherever you're trying to invest your time. If that's Wall Street, if that's the community, if that's your creation, you want to have the pulse of it and everything around it. Because say you're a Pilates expert, right? You're not gonna move that shit to the center of the hood and expect to keep your your monthly payments up unless you're instructed to by spirit. But nine times out of ten, they ain't gonna have you just open one, just like, come on, you know what I'm trying to say? Or like taking. Crazy thing is, if you took your soul food out to the area, they gonna pull up. That's what's so crazy. Bro. But anyway, um, I'm just giving you wait different ways to say, different ways to think because. People have these great ideas, but they're nurturing it themselves with their own understanding. 
And when you do that, when it's time to cultivate it, it's time to pull up your crop, your yield don't come back right. And you're like, Ron, I bought all the pesticides. I put the time in. I done did everything I was supposed to do. Had them on timers. Blacked out the room. I done did everything I was supposed to do. Except when it's time to yield, you got spider mites. Or you got some other shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you done, your whole crop is gone. Because you wasn't paying attention to the little nuances that you were supposed to. You was looking at the every, you was looking at the pH balance and all this extra stuff, but you never regulated the temperature of the room. You didn't have ventilation of the room. So you killed your yield. If you know what I'm saying, you should know what I'm saying. Like I learned that yes, I want to go, 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 which should be a good thing, but you're not accounting for every little thing that can happen. And in life, you can get paralyzed doing that or you can waste so much time doing that or you can just know and stay locked in and you don't have to worry about none of that You're like it's not going it's not going but you got to remember like a like like 20 years here is like not even a second where these people are sitting at or where they at you feel me and they just like okay what is time what is that what is that strange sorcery term what is that sorcery term what is that <laughs> keep that shit over there bro <laughs> so that's why they say he don't come when you want, but he's always on time. Because he's on the right time, not your time. You feel what I'm saying? That's the really shit ever. And if you just get into your mind that you're going to have to prepare yourself and, and do your, be your best self, which means is uh, reestablish your emotion, emotional wealth and you'll be okay. Because you do have to reestablish yourself. Me, last time I was really by myself or out of a relationship when I was a kid. So a lot of my values I was carrying and things I was doing were still 16-year-old shit. Because I never, like had that time by myself to cultivate it and you don't think about it when you're caught in the circle you should I mean, it's my fault but I'm just saying like I'm just telling you what it was just um you get caught on that work home hurry up, you hurry up and spend some time with my wife you, you feel me you do everything that's not important everything that's not yourself you think you're playing a video, video game with your wife is for yourself but it's really not that don't help you when shit hit the fan nigga, I knew everything about Tekken and nothing about me I'm about to say, we're king at, bruh. Send Paul. Nigga, anybody come to me? Fuck, no, aren't you, nigga? You're supposed to have everything within you. And I had nothing to exhibit or to retrieve from. So my shed was a little bit dry, and the little shit I found was dull as fucking fries. So, nigga, like, it was just all bad, bro. A sharp fry probably would have been better than what I had. But, um, you know, the ones you bite and that shit get your gum, you be mad as shit. Motherfucker. <laughs> but look, just, um,. I'm probably sending a lot of information out to you real quick, but basically all I'm trying to say is this. Just do a little bit at a time. Don't look at the whole pie. Just eat piece by piece. Because I, I know I get a lot high anxiety. When I think about everything I have to do, I start getting light, and then it makes me like, fuck. Like, not scared to move, but it's like, what's the point? Nigga, I gotta do all this shit, ain't nobody else from moving around this joint. That's what I'm thinking. And it's like, well, you still ain't walked, so you're doing a lot of talking. You feel me? You're supposed to be matching out with the walking, so. I'm talking about, you mean, days I don't be leaving the house for later, or I'm scared to get started, or. You feel me? So I'm giving you things to help maybe speed up your process and speed up your days to just. Like I said the other day, when you start a race, it's only one foot that goes over the line. When you end the race, it's only one foot that goes over the line before it's over. So just take the first step, or just keep stepping, and eventually you're gonna reach the end. You know what I mean? So, I just want to send you some inspiration, tell you I love you. No one else has told you, genuinely. I don't ask nothing from y'all. Just, just, you know I mean? Nothing, bro. Just have a good day. Because if you have a good day, it means the people around you are going to have a great day, which means they'll take care of you, you can take care of them, and then everybody wins. And then they go home and then spread it again and again and again. You see what I'm saying? So, I love y'all and just have a good day, and I'm, I'm going to holler at you until the next one. Go.